How are you guys doing? Welcome over here to the channel. It's actually been about a month since I've done one of these videos. We're going to be reacting to combat footage. I have not seen any of this footage, by the way. We don't show a lot of this on the channel, mainly due to the fact that YouTube does not like it. They don't allow me to monetize. They will actually channel strike your channel if, if you do try to monetize it and they find out about it. So I just, you know what? We're just going to make it, but I like to show you guys it, and we're going to sift through it. I haven't looked at any of this. My camera guy found it. Uh, I have one clip I'm going to share at the very beginning, and this is this is the one I'm going to be talking about. It's not entirely combat footage, but it's 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 the Russians. I don't know what they're doing. Uh, they've, they've decided to put uh, seven, six, two rounds on top of the head of an RPG. Uh, I don't really know if they realize this, but when it starts flying forward, I, I believe the... Um, I think the tape's probably going to fall off and possibly, I don't think those rounds are going to do what they think. I think they, they're hoping they're going to go like everywhere. I don't think that's the way it works, but good attempt. I don't know. Watch too much Demolition Ranch, I guess, but we're going to go ahead and, and kick this thing off out the gate. I don't know. I don't know what we got. Let's just hit it. Oh my. Talk about incoming rounds. Russian? Possibly. Oh, I've seen this. This is Russians. These are Ukrainians walking in. This is an ambush. You can see the ambush on the left-hand side. The Russians light up. You see the Ukrainians coming in past the tree line. I have seen this before already. I guess I forget because I just I I watch so much stuff. Oh. I haven't seen it from this angle though. Oh yeah, look at him rolling out of contact there. Oh wow. Way to go. That's that's training right there. Let me tell you guys what. Watch out, did it! You see that Ukrainian? I don't know if you oh, I'm not gonna rewind him, but you saw him rolling out of contact as he's shooting forward. This is such a crazy war. Oh, I know this one. This one right here uh, is actually, I sent this over to Matt Best. Brian, you uh, Black go, Rifles, go, go, go. like, dude, yeah, I listen, it's Americans with Brits. I mean, this is close. Look at this. Go! Jump it now! Get out the back bar! Up the back bar. Oh, that is so close. And then they gotta get out of there quick, yeah. It's facing towards us. Huh? It's facing towards us. I don't know if you guys noticed, but there was a bullet holding these limbs as he's running through here. My team. I haven't seen any of this, dude. Oh my God. Move, move back, back. Move now. Move. Come on, mate. Come on, you got this. Storm guard, we gotta move now, we're gonna die. Move. Right. Okay, over this, over this. Come on, my brother. Come on, I've got you. Come on, Dino. Move, move, move. Good man. Come on. Come on. You're okay. You're okay. Come on. Come on. Up here. Last bit. Keep going. Gives me goosebumps, honestly. Come on. Come on, Dino! Come on. This is recent, as you have to tell Green it is. This isn't back in the morning. Move here! Move! Go, go, go! Oh, I gotta lose. Come on, Dino! Come on! We're gonna, come on! Get out, we're gonna go stop! Come on! Move! 
Move. Five. Here. 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 Line down. Line down. Here. Line down. Line down. Okay. Oh, he's shot in the lower line. We need. Where's Ozzy? Okay. Actually, what's looks our like location? What's our situation on? Maybe uh, Stratton on the knee or something? Anything else? Like? Okay. Oh. Someone help! Go! We need some help. Come here. John, help me. Help me. Come on. Go try a walk or we're going to die, man. Come on. Ah. 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 Yeah. Yeah. He's oh. not he's not badly wounded. You are. He's walking off. I'm blown out. Ah. Let's do this. Yeah, tourniquet. Couldn't put one finger under it, it was fine. Okay? He'll be alright, he'll keep his leg. Yeah, that was a good effort, nice and tight. Go on. Let's go. Where's the road, bro? Okay. Where's the road? We're going to get the tank. Okay. Actually, I'm fairly confident this is when they were leaving Lyman. Isn't it? It is, isn't it? Yeah, I've seen this when I was doing all the research on Lyman. This is when they were leaving Lyman, the Ukrainians. This is some good footage, by the way. Where you got this? This is good. This is, I mean, I don't have anything to say about it. I'm just watching it. It's with everybody, it's, I'm just sitting here watching it with everybody. And this is good. This is, this is good. That last one was really good. The one before this, I'm going to tell you guys right now, was most likely, it, it was a very large element of men, so I'm not going to say it was an ambush. It looks like a patrol that went out that ended up ambushing a Russian patrol, is what it looked like. That was a very large element of men. And usually when you go out to do an ambush like that, I guess they could set up the, the rear element to stay back as like you guys saw those guys laying down in the trees. And the smaller group would go up and then ambush, but... This is, once again, this is either Ukrainian Special Forces, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, look, these are civilian homes. Look how destroyed these things are. I don't know if you guys realize this, but Ukraine is not the most wealthy country. It's literally all these people have, it's these little tiny homes. I mean, dude, that thing is destroyed. Oh, God, talk about close contact. God, urban warfare. Dude, it gives me goosebumps watching this. This stuff is... This is this is way different footage than what I've I've seen in the past. This is gonna make me like force me to go on a run. Like to get all the anxiety just out of my system. It's making my palms sweat. Either that or this room's hot. This has gotta be a Russian or oh, an Ukrainian soft unit. Oh, I've seen this. They hit. Is this? Is that a javelin? I think they. I think they smoke a, a BMP or something with a javelin here. That's got. That's got to be the scariest thought to be a Russian and have to deal with that. Oh my God! Is that a Mark 19? That is a Mark 19.
I mean, just absolutely just full send with him. I wonder why he distorted his voice. I'm gonna say he's probably. Ukrainians off or what? My god, are they no, moving no. this thing that quick? Are they sending rounds, grabbing the T&E and then bouncing? They are. DJI has, has got more confirmed than most Russians. I'm just going to throw that one out there so everybody's aware. They 100% do. I don't even know if DJI realize that. Ukrainian forces are using their drones so much. Is this a Mark 19 setup again? Is that what that is? No, it's not a Mark 19. That's a giant base outside. Is that an, it might be an ALGO. God, I wish I knew what they were doing. Send the round, send the round, send the round. Send the round. <laughs> That's exactly what they're saying. Go, 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 send them some. Yep. Yeah. That's hilarious. Talk about ingenuity. Ingen ingenuity. Ingenuity. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Ingenuity. <laughs> He's a D DJI to actually walk around on Oh, God. Oh, I've seen this. This is some World War II type stuff. They literally disable this tank. The guy gets up inside of it and throws a grenade inside of it. That's 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 not. We haven't seen anything like that since literally, literally World War II. And the fact that this has got to be one of the most well-documented wars ever in history. It has to be. It is nuts. Incoming? Yeah, it sounds like incoming to me. This guy's just. These are the Russians. This is the Russian side of things, 100. percent Yeah. <laughs> I will tell you guys this, the Russians are at least good at one thing, is building trench systems. I've personally fought in them in Afghanistan, they're like legitimately perfect. More incoming. God. That little grenade launcher he has on the front of his... <laughs> and look, the Russians are even using DJIs for God's sake. Yeah. They're literally taking these rockets and these helicopters, and they're just lobbing them into the air as high as they can go just so they get the distance off them. See? A couple jobs I wouldn't want in the Russian military: tank driver, BMP driver, anything that's driving anything, and anything that's anything that's being flown. Hard pass. Uh, this was down in Mariupol. This was a while ago. Oh wow. Oh man. My God. That's um fairly confident that's white phosphorus. Just gonna throw that out there. That's terrible. This is when they couldn't get him out of there, so they're doing literally anything they can. Oh the Chesnians, the TikTokers of the world. Look at this guy, he's absolutely getting he's got his headband on, glasses on. Is this them again? It's got to be right. Yeah, these guys are these guys are probably some of the worst fighters over there. I've actually got one I want to share with you. I'm gonna pause real quick because I got another one for you. You ready for this? This is the Chesnians. I just found this one today. I sent this one also to Matt Best. I love sending him stuff randomly in the morning. It's literally how I wake him up. I'm not even kidding. I gotta replay the one we did, we were just started, but I wanna I wanna share with this one real quick before I I forget. So. This is once again the Chechnyan forces, and they are walking, and they're reacting to contact. Is this one in here? Okay, good. I just want to make sure you guys see this. Look at this guy. Comes up with his dragon off. He's like, I'm going to get some rounds on that tree, too. 
This is what I'm talking about. TikTokers right here. They're still dumb in other countries. Look at him. He's literally shooting like, you know, what are they shooting at? Chechnyan TikTokers at its best. All right, here we go. We're going to go back to this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to back up just a tad. All right, here we go. The guy's shooting the RPG. <laughs> oh, I see it. Oh, I see it now. God, the Chessy. They're the greatest. God, they're so bad. Terrible. Oh, wow, this is filmed on a high-quality camera. Ukrainians. Incoming. Yeah. That, this is being filmed on like a really good camera. Well, you said a bad word there. I heard that. It's because he stuck his arm into a broken twig and it <laughs> jabbed him by saw it. He's like, oh god, that hurt. <laughs> Look at the generator. Yeah, they're living in the woods. In these trench systems. You guys see the phone, the phone lines out there? This is the kind of footage I want to go get, Charles. I need, we and you need to go there and do this right here. This is what I need to go do right here. This is, this is, this is. If I ever take a break for a while, it's probably because we're over there getting this kind of stuff. Might have a little bit of a language barrier if they try to attempt to tell me what town we're in. I might just have them Hey, will you record every town for me so I can just overlay it? Oh, here a town. There we go. No idea. Once again. Starlink? Is that what the Oh, was it? Oh. <laughs> they had Starlink in their trench. Where do you go, Tesla? Or Elon? Oh, yeah. Auto loaders. It's caused a lot of deaths, actually. If you guys didn't realize. That's why the turrets fly so high. Russian side of things, isn't it? Yeah, it's gotta be. They always put about a million logos all over the screen for some reason, like they're gonna copyright this drone footage. And I'm never, I'm never convinced that when I'm seeing this from the Russian side of things, that they're actually even relatively close to the front line, because the guy's always so slow and methodical, and the drone's getting a good angle shot. RPG. That looked like an RPG head to me. I've only seen a few of them in my life. Is he sending it? He's sending it. Yep, he sent it. You know sometimes those things don't, don't fly straight at all? Like, at all. Sometimes they'll go like this and they'll like turn left or turn right. Wow, that one did take off this guy. Ooh, they're fighting down in a... Is this recent? This is like, I know I've said this, but we have not seen this kind of combat since World War II. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, there's so much stuff that's just, everything's destroyed. So much destroyed stuff. Look at this. What are we talking about? This guy is just shooting into a, like, definitely clearing this place out. RPG inside of a building? No big deal. TikTok. Of course it's on TikTok. I love how this guy made sure that his uh his his phone was recording. Get him with that grenade. Oh, wow, you know you're they're really close if you're popping a damn grenade inside of your trench.
That's what I'm talking about. With this drone stuff, see how there's like this? This is down in Mariupol. So they've controlled Mariupol for a month now. This is just propaganda being filmed. They're not shooting at anything. You know, I'm going to tell you guys right now, I used our version of this 10 years ago, and they're modern. They're, theirs, the one that they have right now, I mean, you can tell this one hasn't been in, in battle at all. Look how clean it is on the inside. I mean, this thing is literally just used for propaganda. I'm going to tell you guys right now, ours, as in the U.S. military, back when I was using it, was way better than what that one looks like. Like, way better. Like, ours was literally like playing a video game, a joystick. Because if you guys did not know this, like, I'm going to go ahead and pause this just for one second. Because you guys can see, you guys can see these guys holding this thing. Ours in the our military literally is like a joystick, like you'd be playing a video game. They made our stuff with Xbox controllers. Like EOD, our EOD literally uses Xbox and PlayStation controllers because the user, like the individual using it, is so used to using an Xbox or a PlayStation controller, they literally didn't they didn't force a human to readapt to a different type of controller. Like, see this one, that one's awkward looking. Ours was literally a joystick. So if you took like a computer joystick, like you'd play a flight simulator. It'd be the same thing. It made it so easy. This guy, 100%, look how clean he is. This is the other thing. With Russians, when they cover their face, it's always, it's always really confusing to me. If, if they believed in their cause so much and they weren't, wor if they weren't worried about the rep like what's going to happen afterwards, why, why even cover your face? I mean, you're sitting inside of a very clean, brand new BMP. Like, you don't need to cover your face. This thing has not seen war, by the way. I'll tell you guys that right now. This is 100% staged... Look how clean it is. Like, there should be dust everywhere. The guy's hands perfectly clean. His clothes are clean. This whole... Look, look how perfect the Z's are on here. Here's some real stuff. I think I've actually seen this one. This next one. They're going after a bunker. I believe this one is a bunker buster. You know how many times I practice this drill in the military? Not even kidding. Not the reacting contact and bounding, which you're about to see them do. Like, see how they're bounding forward and stuff. That's whatever. But actually physically taking over a bunker? Never in my life have I had to do that. I had to clear bunkers, but there was never anybody in them. Like, this is real. This has got to be some sort of soft unit. Everybody's got suppressors and they actually somewhat look like they know what they're doing. Like bounding and everything looks fine. That's crazy. They're sitting there bounding forward and then a Russian helicopter comes over the top of them. And when I, when I and I know these guys know what they're doing. They're none of them are having to speak to each other when they're literally maneuvering on this bunker. Renata. Oof. Well, I guess the person's AK was in there. Was that his? He just <laughs> that thing. Same group? No, different, different group. Different video. Charlie! <laughs> This is Russians? I believe it is. Yeah, I'm sure it is because the video quality is pretty poor. I know it's a different group of guys. I see red. It's got to be Russian. Good 
Well, now that I'm sweating, I hope you guys didn't enjoy this video over here. Uh, we, we're gonna do, we usually do these things like once a week, but I kind of stopped for a little while. So I hope you guys didn't enjoy it. If you guys want to see more of them, please comment down below. Other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow with another normal, regular episode. I do love you guys. I'm out.